got after the girls, would yell. Praise was very minimal. And when it was praise, you weren't sure if you were actually getting <laughs> praised. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Nice rebound. And, could have jumped higher. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, fantastic, phenomenal coach. Like, knew the yeah. game and had been coached for years. And just, he was not connecting with the girls. And we had a conversation. Hey, either you have to adjust. You, you can't yell as much. You have to adjust how you're communicating. You have to mm-hmm. adjust how you're critiquing. Otherwise, you can't be here anymore. And he said, look, I don't want to change who I am. This is who I am. And okay, thanks for your time. We appreciate the couple of years. Let me know if you need a reference somewhere else. Good luck. And right. I want to have you replaced. And one of the things is it, what I hear a lot is, oh, this next generation is soft. You can't yell at them like you used to. You can't do this like you used to. <laughs> okay. Well, if that's the case, then stop doing that. Like <laughs> what I see a lot of times with the, the leaders I work with or coaches or supervisors is, well, oh, I can't be as hard as on. I can't be as hard as on them. I can't do this. I can't do this. I'm like, well, yes, you can if you adjust how you do it. So can you stand there and say, hey, you have to do this because I said so? No, it's not going to work anymore. 